Welcome to MonroeMotors.com. Here we have a 2023 Corvette C8 Coupe, 70th Anniversary Edition. This is the real deal Anniversary Edition, not just the 70th year. This one is painted in the carbon flash metallic. Really cool color. And then you can only get this in the Anniversary model, this color. So back here at the uh, hood here, you can see it has the glass. It is the coupe, so you can see the engine. Here's the engine itself. It has the uh, red engine cover as well. It's a 6.2 liter V8 that produces 495 horsepower. It's paired to an eight speed dual clutch automatic transmission. It also has magnetic ride control, which is a really nice upgrade. Inside the rear here, we got the rear trunk, so it goes pretty deep. Uh, GM claims you can fit two uh, sets of golf bags back here, so pretty spacious. Um, and we'll close this here. And it does have the soft close. We'll zoom out here. I do have the roof on the car. I elected to keep the roof on because I think it looks really cool. There's your rear camera mirror, and then here's your engine from the outside so people can see it as we come down here. You can see all the carbon flash, so it's got that sparkle to it in the black. Carbon flash badge pack, the carbon flash high wing on this car. And then down below we have the NPP performance exhaust that it comes with the uh, Z51 package. Uh, it allows you to change the exhaust note from loud to quiet and vice versa. Uh, you can do that electronically in the cab. It also has the black exhaust tips, which uh, extend out a little bit so they look a little bit more wider really look great with this uh, paint scheme. Coming to the wheels, the 70th has a unique wheel, so it's a dark uh, gray design, almost like a gun metal, uh, and they're a unique pattern to the, for the 70th uh, Corvettes. We have the Z51 package on this car, so it has the Z51 performance brakes. You can see the edge red brake calipers. And along the rim, you also have that red pinstripe, really cool. Michelin tires all the way around the car. Uh, we have a 305 30ZR20 in the rear. It also says uh, forged on the rim, and it does say Corvette there as well. Okay, coming to the uh, front wheel. You can see the, uh, the brake calipers are larger in the front as well as the brakes. They do say Corvette and Z51 on them. Uh, front tire size is a 245 35ZR19. Okay, making our way to the interior of the car. So we got a really cool interior, unique to the 70th anniversary. It's a 3LT, uh, so it has the Alcantaran uh, door panel. So the, pretty much the whole door panel is Alcantaran in black. We got the red stitch, and it has the black um, trim components instead of the silver aluminum. We do have the memory seating package for the uh, passenger power windows, power locks, and electronic door release. Down here we have the white uh, leather here, and then the black leather below here. So really cool design. I'll show you on the dash here. So you can see even the dash is wrapped in Elkinterran. Beautiful with that red stitch. Down below we have the glove box here. Open that up. It has the owner's manual in here. You got the white glove box, that's leather as well. Again, the black trim here. And I'll show you the uh, door jams here, they're nice. 70th anniversary badge there. Kick plate looks good, nice and clean through the door jams here. I'll show you the carpeted floor mats, they have red stitching around as well. Uh, you got the eight way power seats, so you got power bolster and lumbar as well. And take a look at these seats. Two tone design with the red stitching, so white is the primary color and the black and the red stitching, and the GT2 seats. So you can see the exposed carbon fiber here, it looks really cool. Corvette flags there. You got the seat belt straps here, and you get the red uh, seat belts with the, this model as well. Alcantaran, you're gonna have the B pillar Alcantaran, the A pillar Alcantaran, and as well as the uh, hood, uh, the roof liner and the visors, as uh, all three LTs have. But again, the whole console here, door panels and dash are all Alcantaran on this model. So really cool. Let's close that door, show you this rear spoiler here. So it's the high wing, so you can see the profile there. As we walk down the car, you see the engine there. 
and just look at this paint, just wonderful. I elected to keep the uh, roof on the car because it looks really cool in my opinion. It has the exposed carbon fiber weave here, the carbon flash side pieces there, really looks cool. Top on or off on this car. So come back down here, you see those seats there, really cool looking. We got the carbon flash mirrors here. Then we got our nice 70 badge here. It says 1953 to 2023. Okay, making our way to the front here. It's got the bright LED headlights. And we also have the front splitter on this one. Uh, let's, let's feel down here. Tiny little bit of rub there. Nothing bad, but there is a little bit there. Uh, we do have the front cameras on the on this model as well. And then we'll check out the front trunk here. So the trunk is open here, as you can see. And then down below, we have the uh, front trunk. It goes really deep. Uh, right now we have, I'll put this bag in here. So we got the bag for the roof in here. And then we got the duct work for the Z51 in there. Over here, we got the 12 volt socket. So that's where you would charge your trickle charger. Um, over here is where you put your engine coolant and your windshield wiper fluid there. Okay, we'll close the hood on this one, or the front trunk, I should say. And we'll come back out here so you can see the beautiful paint and just wonderful color. Uh, there is one little touch of a spot there, um, but we haven't polished this car, so it will be diminished. And just a wonderful paint scheme, again, only available on the 70th anniversary car this color. Here's your front wheels. And then coming to the, your rear wheels here. See, they all look wonderful. Okay, making our way back to this door panel. Again, the 3LT model, you get all the nice upgrades. So uh, the Elkintarin door panel on this model, you got the black trim piece here, the memory package for the driver, power mirrors, um, power folding mirrors. I'll hit that button there so you can see it function back out again you also have blind spot monitoring so that'll light up if something's in your blind spot you have your power windows here your power locks electronic door release front and rear trunk again that white leather there and then the white leather door panel here at the bottom so that is real leather with the 3lt showing the dash on this side it has the heads up display slot there because it does have heads up and you can see how cool that dash looks show you the uh jams here sparkling kick plate looks good there's minor little scratches there very very minor although minor nice and clean throughout show you the pedals there floor mats eight-way power seats with a power bolster and lumbar we'll scan the seat here so you can see how great it looks again this is the napa leather because it is the 3lt model so it's the upgraded leather uh, and then we have the exposed carbon fiber there which looks nice and then we have the red seat belts there. And I'll show you back here. You can see the engine compartment from the cab here. So you can see the engine cover there. We have the speaker in the center there. Another 70th badge there. And you got the wireless charging station right in there for your cell phone. Okay, we'll hop in the car. And the cockpit it just looks wonderful with all the Alcantara. And so coming down here, we got the nice sleek uh, vent design here. You got your head, heads up display controls here. Here we got power, tilt, and telescopic steering wheel. Down below we have your dash stimulant and your electronic parking brake. Coming up on the wheel here, you got your headlight controls. Here's your paddle shift for your down, downshift. Z button takes you to your performance pages. We have your um, cruise control settings here. We got stereo audio on both sides here. Heated steering wheel, Bluetooth voice command, your arrow keys for your digital dash, your up shift for your paddle shift and your headlight or windshield wipers controls over here. Uh, it's push button start, we'll start it up. And we'll zoom out here so you can see that wheel. So the, even the wheel is upgraded to the Alcantara uh, black with a nice red center point here. It's got the flat top and the bump outs here. It's got the flat bottom uh, with a nice leather uh, horn cover here with the flags in the center here. And that nice red stitching just continues throughout the whole car here. Zooming into the dash here, we got a full digital date gauge cluster. Mileage on this car, we have 6,873 kilometers. Coming up here, we got the universal garage door opener. 
Uh, and then we have the rear camera mirror, so that's functioning on. You can turn that off if you don't like it. So there, there's your light sensitive mirror. And as we look up here, you can see the, uh, the nice stitching on the, the roof liner there. Coming down here, uh, we'll come to the eight inch touchscreen here. So we got factory nav, I hit that there. Except here. So there's your factory nav, we'll come back here. We have Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. And we got performance data recorder, here's your climate controls. Uh, we have front camera here. So there's your front of your car and your side angles. So you can see you when you're approaching something. And I'll throw in reverse so you can see it has reverse as well. So there's your reverse camera. Come back down here to your automatic transmission controls. Here's your park and reverse. So that's a push pull design. Uh, M right there puts you into your manual mode so you can use those paddle shifters if you, let, if you choose. We got traction control here. We got your front camera button here. And then we got your mode selector here uh, with a nice handle here so you can rest your hand as, you're, if you're, as if you're holding the shifter. Coming to the dash here, I'll turn the dial so you can see, we'll start from the beginning. So you got weather mode, you got my mode, and you can see all the, the metrics changing here. Uh, you got tour mode, sport mode, and track mode. So sport and track open the exhaust up so you can um, hear it's louder now. Coming into the, every time you turn that dial, you can see it changes the steering, the suspension, the engine, the brake feel, engine sound. And uh, PTM there so it changes the different metrics so coming back down here you can see all the Alcantara in here uh, we have two cup holders here and then along the tower here you got dual zone climate control I'll show you up here uh, and then we got heated and ventilated seats and the rest of your climate controls here so we got the Alcantara in here open up this display put my hand in here so you can see how deep it is uh, we do have USB and auxiliary here as well okay I'm gonna open the door I'll throw up the windows, turn on the headlights, and give it a couple revs. Wow, that sounds great. All right, let's open this car up, close that door, make our way to the front, show you those headlights on, nice and bright. What a great looking car. This car looks amazing in the sun. And it, this carbon flash changes colors kind of plays tricks on you so if it's dark it looks black if it's uh, bright and sunny then it's more of a, a sparkle to it more of a charcoal gray so really cool color as we make our way to the back here you see those bright LED tail lights and listen to that exhaust at idle just wonderful okay so here we have it this is a 2023 70th anniversary edition the real deal in carbon flash metallic this one has mag ride and z51 as well uh, with the 3lt interior so this is here and available at monroemotors.com come down and have a look at this one for yourself we look forward to seeing you real soon